Welcome back. It's your Feel Good Breakfast Show Express on SABC3. Joined this morning by a very stressed out crowd Hines. He's been missioning all morning to get this game ready for you, but it's going to be well worth the wait, of course. Crisis 3. That is correct. The long-awaited, indeed. It is the, it is the long-awaited <laughs> Crisis 3. It's the sequel to Crisis 2, as you can imagine. Uh -huh. And the idea behind the game is it's a first-person shooter, yeah. for those you know. And uh, the idea behind the game is that you are a soldier with this epic suit. Uh, as you can see, that you can't see me, now you can. And the idea is that you have energy in your suit. Mm -hmm. And with that energy, you allocate it to different parts of your, of your suit. So you can uh, attempt to uh, tackle a bunch of enemies with okay. uh, different tactical options. So now I'm invisible to the enemies. Right now I'm sneaking up behind these, there are these soldiers in the river over Invis there. Invisible. You can't see me, yeah. actually I'm in the middle. But I'm about to run out of energy, so I'm going to duck behind here. And I'm going to get out my... I should have a bow and arrow. Yes! This is, <laughs> this is how every war should be fought, with bows and arrows. Um, <laughs> like they used to do in back in the day. Like Clearly games have developed far past like, stuff like Duke Nukem 3D. This is like so high tech. Yes, this is, this is high tech. So it's set in the future, and we're in uh, New York City, but it's overrun and overgrown with all this fo foliage. But look at the graphics. The graphics are one of the most amazing wow. features of this game. That, those lighting effects are, you are as impressive. Your eyes. Yeah, and, and they, they are as impressive on console as well, which mm -hmm. is unusual. Um, now I'm gonna just run and gun these guys. Right, so I'm gonna switch you, my suit. That. Now I've got power in my suit. I'm just gonna run. There's a guy. Run it in there. He sees me. Oh. Big time shooting going on. Uh, violence level. Does this require any age restriction? Yeah, it's gonna... it's for adults. So it's you're looking at like a 16 16 year old uh, game. So that's yeah. the that's the age restriction. Okay. Um, but yeah, like uh, it, it, it is your it is your typical shooter. It's yeah. nothing. You're you getting gunned, dude. Oh no, because I'm talking to you. <laughs> but lucky for me, I have my suit with this uh, this high energy. So uh, the, the the campaign is a little short for yeah. my liking. But if you are a Crisis fan, it wraps up the story very nicely. Uh, the graphics are very impressive. Oh no, here comes backup. Everyone's shooting me. This is chaos. So you are one man trying to fight against this entire army of yeah. soldiers but, uh, that are me, just trying to annihilate you. Yeah, that's exactly what's going on. But let me like take take a take a rest somewhere behind this car when they won't see me. Yeah. I'm just going to switch on my suit. Right. So no, invisible? I'm invisible. No one can will be able to see me. This guy is trying to take cover. And then you're uh, just I shouldn't walk in the water. I'm, I'm, I might uh, attract their a, attention. Make a yeah. splash. <laughs> make, a, make a splash. I like just what you did there. Just him. Just put yeah, him there. Right we go, there we go. There we go. Oh, Boom. damn. He's got a suit as well of some cool. kind. At Somebody's throwing a grenade here. I need to run away. During all of this excitement, I'm asking to calm down. Let you know at home that you stand a chance to winning this either for the PC, for the Xbox 360, or for the PS3. Now, what you got to do is SMS the keyword, which is game, including your name and your city and your choice of console to 33728 and you could be the lucky winner of this beautiful, awesome game. It'll Lots keep you entertained fun. for long, long times. Crisis 3, right? Yes, Crisis 3. Awesome stuff. Now, today we've been putting in quite a big fo focus on men. We were talking about fashion, uh, fashion early on. Did you pay any attention about getting the right kind of suit? I saw Graham. Graham looked yeah. quite bling but now in we, that suit. Now we're taking it a step further because men also deserve to get pampered from time to time. You know, you want to get your massage and you want to relax after a stressful week. And so we sent Mpo over to the Life Day Spa in Rosebank where she met with some unlikely characters, people you'd never ever think you'd find in a spa. Take a look.